Hello guys and welcome back to episode 6 of The Walking Dead. Now, we are picking up right where we did leave off. So, let's get back into it. So, hey, I guess we're stuck here. Georgia's cities and their current level of disaster are as follows. Atlanta, stage 9 catastrophe. Augusta, stage I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. You gotta do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. Like the girl from upstairs. Are you just gonna let them? You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Anyway, see you around. Oh my god. So, I guess we're talking to people. Hey, Ken. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. I think you know what you're doing. Shit, man, do any of us? With Clementine, I mean. Earlier, you said you were clueless. I just want you to know that I look at you and I see the type of guy who figures things out. That girl's gonna be just fine. Thanks, Kenny. You got it. Nice one, Kenny. Yeah, I guess you're getting fast enough to speak to Doug. Oh. How you doing, Doug? Doug? We couldn't save her, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I... I know it's stupid. We just met. It's dumb. But, uh, I mean, it's, it's probably just that survivor thing. But I really liked her. She liked you, too. Thanks, Lee. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it, buddy? How did you choose? I mean, we both needed you. You picked me. Oh my god. I thought you needed help. No. I guess that makes sense. But it wasn't a choice like that. It, it was just something I did. I don't know why. I just wish you would have picked her. Ah. Okay. I want to speak to the gang speaks to the cool kids his mini gun on his shoulder it's all like pow 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 I thought super dinosaur was toast but you know what he wasn't oh and then hey duck uh, you want to cool it for a minute okay sorry I'm sorry there's uh, not a lot of kids here no it's not that it's I got grabbed again I was there though I fell and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. No. It's just a walkie-talkie. Oh, it probably, probably wasn't much use to begin with. Wouldn't it be amazing? It wasn't just a walkie-talkie. Season, season I know four. it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. Um. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Let me go deal with this. Oh, I'll man, speak Clementine. after we speak to this guy. The racist. You, you like my daughter? I 
Her dad tried to kill me, so... Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Hey, Lee, do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That reporter is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor in's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Ben, lost roads. Next time. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? Keep it. Hey, I owe you a lot more than a half-eaten candy bar. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy, I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's Ooh, coming, Lee. The John brothers. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. You fuck with us! Now we're gonna take what we want! There's too many of them! Ben. No more, please. Please, please. <laughs> and what a teaser that is! Jeez, guys, sir. What I was say, what I was going to say was, before we take a look at the choices here, what I was going to say was. Um, wouldn't it be amazing if in season four, the new one coming out this year, um, which I will be doing on my channel definitely, um, wouldn't it be amazing if, like, Clementine had a backpack on, let's say, and, I don't know, she somehow managed to fix her walkie-talkie, and she heard something coming from it and it was Glenn because we haven't seen Glenn since season one that would be amazing and it would make sense as well you could say you know we I've been trying to contact you I've been trying to speak to you I think it would make sense um but the chances are he's not alive so we'll have to see maybe he's got a little group together um, sir, honesty, lied to Herschel, of course I was honest, Duck or Sean, I chose to save Duck, um, I retract that choice, I would much rather have saved Sean, loyalty, I defended Kenny, of course, Kenny's a good man, mercy, gave her the gun, Although I'm in the minority, I think I made the right choice. She wanted it, so I mean, honestly, 
I think I did her a favour. Who would you save? Doug or Carly? More people chose Doug. That's amazing because when I first played this game uh, back in 2012, like, the decision was like 75% Carly, 25% Doug. So I'm guessing people have gone back and chose Doug and now it's a split. So, let's continue. No, don't tell me we have to watch all this. So guys, that has been episode one, a new day of The Walking Dead. I will see you very soon with episode two, Starved for Help. Bye guys.